This is the latest innovation in breast cancer technology being tested. Usually the disease is diagnosed using a mammogram or an x-ray of the breast. The problem with digital x-rays is that when the lady has dense breast, breast tissue, and that happens in almost half of women, particularly those aged between 40 and 50, that density can mask the cancer. This machine is able to x-ray the breast and take an ultrasound at the same time, penetrating dense breast tissue to reveal any cancer. This is the world's first system that incorporates both these technologies into a single platform. So the idea would be that you can catch that breast cancer early in one go, rather than having to ask the woman to come back repeatedly for more uh, studies in the future. When Nora, who's also a mammographer, discovered a mass in her breast, which later turned out to be benign, she volunteered to help developers with testing. It's a very user-friendly machine um, compared to many of the other digital machines that I've worked with before. It's, it's good to see that there's so much progress being made, um, especially when you think of the time that you need to have the mammogram and have an ultrasound afterwards. Early test results show the machine to be safe and effective. Development began six years ago and it's cost about $3 million. Studies by doctors around the world suggest that around five of every thousand women tested with a mammogram x-ray have a tumor detected. That total rises to around 12 of every thousand tested with an ultrasound. Now, the developers of the Akeso say its technology will provide women with access to better quality cancer testing without having to undergo two separate tests. Both the developers and the government say the machine, which costs $350,000, can be used to reach a large number of people. We would like to see greater manufacturing capability in South Africa and developing this machine in our country and then being able to market it to Europe, we hope eventually to the United States and throughout the African continent and to, through this development, make a difference to the health status of women. While women will save time and money, developers say the greater benefit will be the quicker detection of cancer to save lives. Famida Miller, Al Jazeera, Cape Town.